Hello, hello. Welcome to the Ecliptic Spiritualist channel. I'm Ranita, and our topic today is Saint Expedite and how fast he brings fast luck um, ur to urgent situations, fast money, and court cases as well. So let's dive right into why do we use Saint Expedite. Now this is Saint Expedite here. This is a candle that I design and use when I am working with Saint Expedite. Now Saint Expedite feast day is April the 19th of every year. So that's a day where a lot of us that do workings, uh, we do uh, expeditious type work on that day because he is active. That's a festive day and honoring him. So we do do altar vigils for that. If you're interested in that, you may go to our website and uh, we do that in the uh, product section and you can purchase for that kind of service that we do. So moving right along, Saint Expedite is a Patreon, okay, or Saint uh, frequently used in the hoodoo practice. A lot of people are very familiar with Saint Expedite that practice in the hoodoo tradition of folk folk work workings, those that live in New Orleans or in the southern states. Okay. And you will see him a lot, you know, in New Orleans and all around in the southern states, for those that are practitioners such as myself or those that are um, non-paganism, okay? So St. Espedite is, is for those who hope for rapid, rapid solutions um, to problems that has plagued them or really tired of their old life. That's what I like to call him. Um, if you're tired of your old life, well, St. Expedite, um, this particular patron um, saint is for you. Your, if you have your wish or your um, things that you have been petitioned to end delays, he's very quick about ending delays. So this is a few areas, but not limited to that he helps with. Okay, and that is um, bad habits, um, get out of jail, fast luck, fast love. Urgency for fast money, court cases, procrastination. Um, his feast day again is on the 19th, and his number is actually the number three. The number neurologically, his neurological number is three. And I do spells for clients on the 19th and full blown uh, spell workings with St. Expedite. Okay. And again, you'll find a link down below. Um, or in the description box if we're in that season of the feast. But all along, I do do spiritual work with him. I find that he and Alekba work very well in dire situations, okay? Now, Expedite is depicted as a young Roman and in centurion dress holding a loft, um, a cross marked Houdi, H-O-O-D-I-E, and that means in today in Latin, it means today. Okay, and he's stepping on a crow beneath his feet. And um, this one that I've designed, you will see that the crow is under his feet there. You will see that, okay? And so um, seeing that crow beneath his right foot is out of... The, uh, the dying crow's mouth issues a word of a is a ribbon that's written around him called cross or it's called c r a s in latin and it means tomorrow so expedite saint expedite destroys a vague tomorrow in favor of today so he is very quick about it means to him today move what today. So he eliminates procrastination and move today and with speed. Um, now this particular Patreon is saying you don't have to work with him on an ongoing basis. You know, sometimes with certain saints or patrons that we work with, we build an ongoing relationships or bring in homage to them. But in this case with Saint Expedite, you don't have to do that. You use it one time, petition him, Boom, you know, then you put it to the side. And then if you need him again, you can pull it back up and, and work with him again. Um, this is the best way of working with him in, in my style is for working with him. You would need a glass of water on your altar for him. You have a glass of water, a St. Expedite candle, or you can have an Saint Expedite, 
expedite card. Um, I do a candle. That's my style. So you choose the way that you would like to work with St. Expedite. Always know that it is your practice. You are a practitioner. So you work the way you work. This is the way that I work. Okay. Um, I use brown oil as well. To, it's a speedy blend. This is it here. I use this particular oil. Um, it's a it's a it's a speed blend that I use, and um, so if you're ever interested in that, you can always comment down below. Um, it's not many out there like this, but it's by L Chief Special Brown Blend. I love this particular blend of speed. Um, it's very rare to find that oil, even though I make design my own oils when I'm doing ritual work. But in this case, was case with say expedite, I always pull out my trusty L Chief Special Brown oil because it's extremely rare to find, and you will not find it. Um, but you can use whatever blend of oil that you like to use for for speed that you may design for yourself. Um, you always want to use flowers with him. Now, you can use red. My preference is yellow, as you can see. I am doing some work with him. I like to use yellow. Okay, that's my preference, but you can use red. Um, I also use red for speed with the candle for him as well. You can use red or yellow. I prefer red because red is about speed on the color spectrum when dealing with uh, working with magic and candles, which is one of the quickest, easiest ways, in my opinion, is a love with, I, I work with fire all the time. Um, the only, only thing else that you need in addition to with this is a petition written. You can write it on Joss paper that we offer on our website. You can use parchment paper or you can use brown paper and place it underneath your candle. All right. Always know that you should always clean your candle. Okay. Your candle should not, uh, you should not just light a candle and not uh, fix your candle up. If you need information, it will be in the description box down below and how to prepare your candles. Okay. Um, and also when you're working with him, when you get ready to light your candle, and you once you light it, you want to clap your hands, and that wakes him up. Okay. Now you want to clap your hands three times. One, two, three. Or you could use a bell, a ring a bell, one, two, three. And this wakes him up. Why Ranita does it wake him up? Well, Saint Expedite was uh beheaded. Okay. So this is a, a tradition of Clapping your hands three times to summon him to wake him up, or you can ring a bell three times. Some people use their bells on their altars, okay? And you want to express exactly what you want uh, to present. You want to express exactly what you want to present to him uh, in the present tense and ask how to find a way to get it to you. Ask him, you express what you need to say, and you ask him to find a way to get it to you now. Make sure you um, spend time with your altar, prepare it with him with the candle or a card or, or, or a card if that's your preference. Make sure you anoint your candles. Um, you can always make sure you have flowers presented. You can use yellow or red. Um, make sure you spend time every day until you receive your answer. Allow the candle to burn each day as well. Okay. Uh, once the petition is granted, uh, you must, without any exceptions, you must offer him a glass of uh, wine. Okay. So in the beginning here, you want to always start off with a cup of water, your flowers, your candle, or you can use a card and use a red candle and you want to anoint it. You don't necessarily have to use this particular blend that I use. You can use whatever oil that you use with um, anointing and firing up your candle. But after everything is done and he's granted it, you want to make sure that you offer him a red wine and some pound cake. You must offer him red wine and pound cake. It could be homemade pound cake. It could be pound cake from your local grocery or market, okay? No exceptions, no exceptions, okay, whatsoever. 
You could offer him a whole pound cake if you like, or you could offer him slices, arrange it on a plate with coins. I like to place uh, dimes on my pound cake arranged on there, so I, I place coins. Now, usually dimes, that's what I like to use. You can use whatever coin you like to use, and I place it on top. Um, now, uh, once a few days have passed, um, take the cake outside, okay, for the birds and pour the wine and the water as a libation um, to the earth, okay? So you're going to pour the wine into the ground, you're going to pound the water into the ground as libation, okay, um, into the earth, all right? Give the coins to the poor, so take those coins and give it away, uh, and you must uh, tell a friend. So when you take the cake outside for the birds and you pour the wine and the water as libation to the earth, take it farther out and the birds will come and eat that. Okay. Um, and that is a representation of the crow um, on the depictment of a Saint Expedite um, patron saint. Okay. Now, uh, you must tell a friend of how Saint Expedite has helped you or helped you. So you could text it, you could put it underneath this particular video, you could put it, you know, write it somewhere and tell a friend or whatever. You must tell someone, no exceptions, okay? Um, how Saint Expedite has helped you, or he will take back uh, what he helped you with plus some and will not help you again okay so those are some firm uh requirements to work with saint expedite all right uh follow those to a t you will get the result that you desire okay always do it in the present tense every day till your candle burns out work the energy of the altar all right follow everything to a t and you'll be fine it's a great patreon to work with saint expedite um he's an awesome patron saint to help fast results okay and saying that i love you for watching today don't forget to click that wiggly bell down below ding dong ding to make sure that you're getting our daily videos with the intuitive um readings tarot readings that come on a daily basis don't forget that we offer spell work root work rituals we work with um we do offer energy healing and reiki through distance through online which is through skype or through uh facetime we also have so many rare services you can go to our website and, and visit our blog we have a spirit school a mini spirit school that's on patreon that you're more than welcome to join so you could and um, heighten up your spiritual practice um, we have a book club that we offer, and we now currently are offering classes every other week on Zoom for the North Node Tribe here on this channel. So I love you for watching today. Don't continue to grow and go in your practice. And don't forget to believe in who yourself first, always. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.